Welcome to day five, giving back and volunteering. Deep down inside, all of us, we want to feel that we have contributed. We want to feel that we have added value and that we've had some kind of meaning and purpose in our lives. Giving to others helps us to feel that we have made that difference. Giving back and volunteering is a recipe for living with passion. Giving is not just about making a donation. It is about making a difference. There are many health benefits to be gained from giving back and volunteering. Longer lifespan. Volunteering as you age can help with developing a healthy body because you are active. You're keeping busy as time goes by and that helps with your overall lifespan. Lower blood pressure. When you're volunteering, you are actively moving, which creates a form of exercise. Whether you're helping plant trees or helping kids every day after school, it all benefits. When your body is moving in a set routine consistently, it's getting necessary exercise, which helps with lowering blood pressure. Increase happiness. Expressing gratitude helps people feel more positive emotions relish good experiences, improve their health, deal with adversity, and build strong relationships. Make an impact. Looking to make a real lasting difference in this world? Unlike other aspects of life you may not be able to control, volunteering allows you to choose where and how to make a difference. It's easy to get inspired with a cause you truly care about and it's rewarding to see your direct impact. It helps with depression. Whether it is volunteering or donating cash, selfless action can help lessen the risk and symptoms of depression and anxiety due to focusing outside of oneself. Improve self-esteem. People who give their time to help others through community service have greater self-esteem, life satisfaction, and sense of purpose. Grow as a person. When you are engaged in philanthropic and humanitarian activities, you somehow can't help but be touched as a human being. Your emotional awareness increases, your care and consideration for others is awakened, and you are exposed to new and different people. You will grow as a person. Lower stress levels. Giving time and assistance to others reduces the mortality risk tied to stress, a known risk factor for many chronic diseases. Here are some reasons to volunteer. You will develop new skills. Gaining skills, knowledge, and expertise are common side effects of volunteering. Giving others your time brings you interesting and challenging opportunities that might not come along otherwise. Make social connections. Loneliness and boredom are common among retirees. Volunteering can, release, can relieve this sense of social isolation and help you fill empty hours in the day. Give back to your community. Doing something for the community that you live in and returning the favor to those who have helped you as strong motivators. Everyone, rich or poor, takes from society, and volunteering is one way to show a sense of appreciation. Develop and grow as a person. Volunteering is an excellent way to explore your likes and dislikes. Gain new perspective. Life can be hard. And when you're feeling down, your problems can seem insurmountable. Volunteering can offer a new perspective. Seeing people who are worse off than you are, yet still hanging in there, can help you see your life in a whole new light. Know that you are needed. Feeling needed and appreciated are important, and you may not get that appreciation from your home life, where the things you do are expected or taken for granted. When you volunteer, you realize just how much you are truly needed. Meeting people who need your help is a strong incentive to continue. People are depending on you. 
If you don't, who will? Boost your self-esteem. Melon volunteers experience a sense of increased self-esteem and greater self-worth. Helping others makes you feel good about yourself because you're doing something for someone that they couldn't do for themselves. Research has shown that the good feelings you experience when helping others may be just as important to your health as exercise and a healthy diet. But it's a smile from a child or thankful person that shows you're really making a difference in someone's life. And that is the greatest feeling in the world. Here are some ideas for giving back and volunteering. Organize a yard sale for charity. Visit a senior center. Tutor a student. Fix and serve meals. Serve on a community board. Volunteer at a shelter. Lead, lend a hand to little ones. Hospital need a lot of people to help with the newborns. Action plan. Select one or two things you will do to give back or volunteer. Match up your giving and volunteering with your values, strengths, and talents. Don't forget to share in the Facebook group in the Day 5 thread. Bye for now.